So this is a scene I had. Uh, um, I, I have it's a bathroom. So th this is these are tiles, and this is the shower cabin. And I have an imaginary line here, and I want the tiles to randomly go against this line. So this point and this point should uh, should be the ends, but in between it can vary. A little bit so how I did this is with um, I, I modeled a small tiles this is five by five centimeters so and uh, how I shaded it was with the uh, vertex paint so I can go in here I will just put a screencast here first. okay so uh, I use vertex paint here, so like you can choose another color here just for for showing. So here I can change to red, for example. So and uh, afterwards I modeled this. This has a grid. So if I use here, you see that this is the same size as this one. It's five by five centimeters. And I used particles on this one, so it's um, emitter hair, and uh, yeah, the rotation just to to match this one, and uh, it's one one uh, one particle per per face. It's in middle of the faces, so I can I don't don't remember what it was. Yeah, and here object I choose this one. Ruta is the, the small one here. So it's the the object. And uh, afterwards, I use I use the weight map on this one. So it's the you can see it when I put the wireframe. So in here I can paint the shortcuts are F. For changing the brush size and the control F to changing the weight. This is for adding and uh, this is for re removing. Yeah, and you can see here maybe. So I can just paint here, uh, add some objects here or around this axis. And to remove, I use this one, change the size a little bit. Yeah, something like that, maybe remove here, add. Yeah, some things like that, I don't know. If I exit this one I'd, and render, I get this. Uh, yeah. So. so what I did, we can also experiment with different designs. We just uh, choose this one and make a duplicate. So I just hide this one. I call it two. And we can just paint another variant. Maybe I think this kind of stair, I like this kind of kind of stair like design I just maybe something like that see how it becomes yeah why not so this is the final render so if I uh, put some dimensions here also yeah, that's it.